Million Studios in Hollywood gets the hidden envelope. Angelica, come on down. You're the contestant on the hidden envelope. And now, your host of the hidden envelope, Patrick Seastar. Thank you very much, everyone. Thank you very much, and welcome to the hidden envelope. This is our second episode of the hidden envelope. Thank you, Donald Mitchell. You're welcome. Alrighty, let's get the song load. All right, Angelica, how are you? I'm feeling pretty fine. Great. So what are you gonna do if you win a million dollars or more today? Buy a lot of toys. Alright. Well, in order to play the game, you gotta find out how many envelopes you're gonna get, so let's head on over to the contract wheel! Alright, Angelica, this is the contract wheel, where we determine how many envelopes you will get. One, two, three, four, five, or six envelopes is how many envelopes you can get. Hopefully, you'll get six, because you can get all the envelopes, but there's a catch. If you find the zero dollars in any of the envelope, the game is over and you walk away with nothing. Alright, I get it. Alright, so spin the wheel, Angelica. That's a good spin. Hopefully, we'll get a good amount of envelopes. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Go, 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 go. There you go! Three envelopes! Barely! Alright, so we have six envelopes, and these have been randomly determined by shuffling of this entire stack of envelopes. So, pick an envelope, Angelica. Envelope number one, please! Alright, envelope number one. It is... the mystery prize! Let's see what it is. It is a hint. That's new. So what that means is that you can ask any question about what could be inside the envelopes. And we will give you an answer to that question. So ask away. Is the wheel in any of the envelopes? The wheel is unfortunately not in any of the envelopes, so you can't go to the wheel and go for a billion dollars. I'm sorry. Well, it was worth a try. Alright, um, pick again. You have two envelopes left. Number three. Number three is... Oh, I see who I'm at. The mystery prize, again. The mystery prize is another hint. Second time we have our new feature, so Angelica, ask away. Does any one of the remaining envelopes get you to the super envelopes? There is one envelope that will get you to the super envelopes. Okay, now. We will show you which envelope it is to the home viewers, but not to you, Angelica. So, the envelope that it is in for your home viewers is this envelope right here. Alright, that was only viewed at the viewers at home. Everyone at the studio has no idea what's in the remaining envelopes. Think again, Angelica. Envelope number five, please. Envelope number five. It's the mystery prize. And what is it? I bet you viewers at home know. Spoiler alert! It is the super envelope. So, Angelica, we will... We will reveal what's in the envelopes you did not pick before you go to the super envelopes, which are located right below us. Alright, in envelope number two, it was... 
Oh no, Angelica. It was half of a million dollars. Wah, wah. Anyway, let's see what envelope number four contains. Five hundred dollars. Still okay. And for the envelope number six. $5,000. So, two okay amounts. One kind of big amount. And three mystery prize envelopes was the result of today's draw. Now, we go on to the super envelope. We have super envelope number one, super envelope number two, and super envelope number three. You get to choose one. If you pick the spin again thing, then you get to pick a second envelope. Alright, which one do you want, Angelica? Envelope three. Envelope three. It is the spin again, so that means it's down to the wire. One of the envelopes has the big money wheel, which you can have to 20 million and not a billion. And the other one is the fail, which means you get absolutely nothing. All right, Angelica, pick. I'll pick number two. Number two. That was the first choice, I think. It, no, it wasn't. Number two is... The Big Money Wheel! All right. And that means number two, number one, number one, but you have to fail. Gonna bring out our our big money wheel. All right, thank you for the effects, everyone. And um, here's the big money wheel. It's a little different from our first episode. We had to make a change immediately after our first episode. Since there is a jackpot on our main wheel and not this wheel, this is a minor wheel. The other wheel is a major wheel. Since there is a jackpot on it and we didn't want you to get confused by which is which, um, we removed it. Another reason we removed the jackpot from this wheel is because it's so low. It starts out at a million dollars and only goes up by 50,000. We decided to remove it completely and it's gone forever. So, instead, we moved the 20 million dollars, our top prize, to where the jackpot was. And we we introduced from Spin for Half a Million the Uno Spin Wedge. If you spin it and land on that wedge, it's really spin again, which means you have to spin the wheel again. If you land there again, you have to spin the wheel again. If you land there again, keep spinning until you land on something up and then the Uno spin. Alright? So you got it? Good. Be careful to see when you land there, you get nothing. So spin the wheel, Angelica. There we go. So, what do you think you win? Oh, hopefully a million. Oh no! How close! Angelica, but you landed on zero dollars. No! Don't worry, Angelica. I think you'll probably get another chance. Maybe another season? Oh. I better come back for another season. If I win zero dollars again, I'll scream like I did t tonight. Ugh. Look at how close that was, folks. She was like one inch away from 15 million, but instead she got nothing. So, it's a pretty sad episode of The Hand of the World, but, um, hey, 
Don't be lying luck all the time. Thank you for watching. And this is Patrick Star telling you to help control the pet population. Have your pets spray on you. Goodbye, everyone. This is Donald Mitchell speaking for the Hidden Envelope, a Spit for Million Channel 1 production in association with Shadow Yosef and One, the L4GS TV Company, WOMG Channel 4, and others.